Hello guys, what's up? My name is Master V. Welcome back today. Um, I just want to say, uh, sorry I haven't been doing videos in a while. I've been kind of focused on live streams, and I don't really want to be focused on live streams because I mean, they're sort of hard to do. Just because you know, live streams, you, know, you have to have like an hour of like, you know time, and uh, yeah. I'm sort of doing more videos and live streams if I can. Okay, but today I have a combo that. I would like to have one of the best Demo Knight combos in the uh, um, we are almost the same subs, so it would be very good to have 67 subs right now, so a sub would be very, very appreciated. Especially because, you know, I'm starting to get better, it's, you know, kind of been, and especially just because of school, it's been kind of hard to put out videos, I mean, videos, I have to edit them, so, eh. But I'm going to be talking about probably one of the best, um, setups for, uh, Demo Knight. Uh, Roblox merch, blah, 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 the Discord, but, uh, yeah, let's get into this. So, the setup that I have at the moment is Squire Boots, Bloody Bracer, and Soul Sucker. This is my opinion, I just want to put that out there, because a lot of people don't take this stuff as an opinion, and they take it as fact. But, um, might just send me, uh, comments on what you think is the uh, best, like, death knight setup. But why I like this so much is because, one, the shield bash doesn't do much knockback. The shield bash doesn't, doesn't do much knockback, so that's, there's, that's one of the things I really like about it. Let me actually go over the stats of it. So, uh, yeah, you can kind of see here, uh, no direct damage, but it does bleed, which is, I think is really good. Soul Sucker, uh, like every time you kill somebody, you get like a little bit extra health, and Squire Boots. You actually get a uh, 10% uh, faster speed on wearer, uh, wearer, so that's cool. But, uh, yeah, so... Some of the range on here is incredibly... Okay. Some of the range on here is very weird, and... Some, like, you saw that, like, sometimes I'll hit, like, really far, and sometimes I won't hit, like... See? Like, what? What range was that? I was, like, right here, and I sliced them. Like, what range do you play with? Oh. But, uh, yeah. So, it looks like three souls is, like, uh, kinda like the max amount of HP you can have. Uh... Need some help now! You also get 220 It's also like, I've tested a lot, I've like, tested a lot of and it seems like this one is really the best for any map. I mean, there are some that would be better for other maps, but this one just seems to be literally the best for like all maps. It's like, it's a good, it's a good, it's a good, like, setup oh. for, like, all maps. Not saying it's oh. the best map, it's not, not saying it's the best one for every map, but it's pretty good for all maps. So, I don't really like, uh, the shield bash damage, so I just chose the, uh, bleed. Also, it gives, like, it gives, like, less knockback, but it just, it seems like it gives less knockback to me. So, I mean, when you're a bit in uh, a class, you don't really want to have knockback on any of your stuff. Because, I mean, uh, what do you do there? The person that you're trying to aim for. Uh, like, okay, miles away. Like, you know, kind of what do you do? So 
as you can see, like, only, like, we have a lot of points, and especially if you, like, kind of figure out how much of the Yeah, there's situations like that where it really does not go well, and then, you know, get the assist. <laughs> yeah, there's situations like that where you can't really, like, do anything about them. You kind of just have to rush in. But, that's kind of the only downside to, like, not having bad and then there's lag like that. What is that lag? So I do about 80 damage to people before uh before they uh, stop bleeding. Which, I think that's, like, pretty amazing, to be honest. Like, that's 80 damage. That's, like, almost all of Scout's health. So let's get this sniper right here. Okay, you see, no knockback. That's why I love that. Because I think it does, like, more damage over time. Like, but, uh, yeah, so I'll go, uh, one more time. But you see, like, 15 points, 4 deaths at max. Not saying this is the best for every map, but dang, this can be really good, depending on how you use it. So, yeah, let's do... Another one here. Mission begins in ten seconds. Let's try this out Five, again. Yeah, so, yeah, thanks. See how long we've been recording. Two, Seven minutes, one. so that's not too bad. Not too bad. So another just thing I really like about this is that like just to me it's way easier than a lot of the other like classes. I mean, Dem Demo Knight is just one of those easier classes, but, like, sometimes I'll get made fun of because, you know, I mean, technically, and it is the truth, all you do is click, uh, left mouse button. I mean, that is true, but it's still, like, really good class, and a lot of people will make fun of classes like Pyro and Groot because of that, but, like, that's what their class was made for, and I mean, it's like, oh, brute to get a nerd. First soul. First soul is always a good one to get because, like, if you can just just get past soul three, you are set. I literally mean, you are set. That's why, that's why I love the bleed. That can happen. You're, you're dead way before this dude dies. Ah. Just wasted a, uh, shield charge. Yeah, you can be dead way before the other dude that you hit with your shield bash dies. Also, I feel like the, this sword, the soul sucker, just has extended range. Like... I don't know why, just I really feel like it. Dispenser down! Okay. Just, yeah, I really feel like it has like way too much extended range. It doesn't even say that it has extended range, it just says, you know, I really feel like it's like a bit of a soul. The dead. Again. Although this is pretty good, it's not the best for all maps, but still. This can get you very far along. The only thing that, that you would have problems with is probably with um, Pyros, as I kind of showed you, and uh, Brutes. But if you can get behind a Brute and just, just slash, slash, slash them, then you'll be good. So basically, Pyro is really the only class you wanna look out for, especially if they have like a 
Dragon's Fury, I think. Let me see. Uh, ah, sorry. Dragon's Fury. So always be careful if they have that, because that can lead um, to a uh, you inevitably die. Also be careful of uh, scouts. <laughs> just just be careful of scouts. Just because they do have that like extra. Just because they do have that extra like that extra speed. Like I would really recommend not engaging scouts. But you know, if you have three souls or at least three souls, I think you're okay with taking down a scout. Cause scouts, they are literally. I, I'm gonna take this from a lazy purple, like one of my Attention. favorite Team Fortress Two YouTubers. But uh, scouts are literally stickmen with a shotgun, and they manage to be one of the best classes only because of their speed. So if you were to combo this with a scout speed, you can really start to see. How much scouts rely uh, on? Uh, yeah, <laughs> you can really see how much uh, scouts start to rely on their uh their speed. But, uh, yeah. And I'm really not the best at demo night, so even though you're seeing me like, holy, jeez, lag. Huh. Oh, now the dude's saying about packs. Oh. Yep, thanks, mate. Oh. And once you are at three souls or higher, you are now at a uh, max speed that you can get. And basically, now you can start screwing people up. Chop people just like that. Help now! Demo is especially good for this map, just because of like how fast you can go. Like you, this is basically about scout speed. And boom, two points right there. Yeah, you can see six points, two deaths. Not too shabby. This is probably one of my favorite classes just because of the unlimited power that you can manifest. Look at that. And you even get critical hits for charging and slicing with your sword. It's amazing. Yeah, that's down here, you'll even see, just, it's absolutely like, crazy about how fast and how much per shit, per season, per shit, ah, you know, I'm just, it's crazy how, like, fast these guys can go, cause like, this is about scout speed, look at this, look at this dude, thank you, thanks, like, I'm practically on par if not faster, with scout speed, which is crazy. So yeah, really, really good. I think this is literally one of the best setups in the game. And I'm talking about in the game. Uh, class that makes it even more like how. But uh, yeah. I think that's all for uh, today's video. Uh, sorry I haven't been posting any, uh, well, too many videos lately. I'm kind of focusing on live streams. I want to change that because, I mean, sure, live streams are fun, but uh, they take up a lot of time in my day. So, uh, yeah. With that being said, uh, Roblox, Merch, blah, 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 Discord, blah, blah, blah. I'll, I'll leave a link to them in the description. And, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Peace.